Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another edition of What's Cooking Destinations. We're here at Macaluso's in Horton, supporting our Italian heritage for the Casa Italiana reunion. We're going to see my good friend Biagio is going to perform tonight. We're going to have people like Joe Causey here. And you never know who you're going to see that we're going to interview. So anyway, let's go in, go on in and check out the show. Alright guys, we're back. We're back with the guy that we came to see. The guy that's keeping Italian heritage alive. And let me tell you something. I've known this guy for such a long time. Actually, I've known you since my waist size was yours. <laughs> <laughs> we but know each other for a long time. 30, 30 something years, bro. At least. One I, yeah, it did. It did. This guy used to be at Casa Italiano. That's why I didn't even realize this was a reunion. Yeah. To look, people in Brick today told me. You know, that's because of the Italiana re reunion, so that was like a Saturday night stop for us. But we go back a long way. Absolutely. And uh, I, did not, I did not realize how popular you are. I'm speaking to the Jersey Shore here because we've expanded. It's not just Jer you know, what's cooking Jersey Shore anymore. We're all over the place. But I didn't realize when we turn around and we put together that, you know, the, the thing for Atlantic City, right, we right. put flyers out. I turn around and told, I told, yeah, I call him Blaze, but yeah, because, Biagio. because that's right. Everybody knows me as Blaze. Yeah, but uh, I, your wife, I just talking to your wife. She didn't believe you. You're kidding me. I said, no, he's very popular in South Jersey. <laughs> so basically, you know, just tell the public what got you, what got you into this. And well, we always we wanted to keep our Italian heritage alive, and what I did is taken old songs that we used to grow up to. Our parents played on the radio or on the record. And yeah, I just record. try to bring back life into the songs to get the younger generation, as well as us, back to enjoy the music we remembered when we were young. And you're doing a great and, job. And I'm trying it. to keep it alive. Basically, we got to keep our time heritage alive. Absolutely, absolutely. It's, uh, it's, an, it's like an honor to see that after all these years, only a couple of the musicians that I remember from well, way you, back in the day. You were in the band? Yeah, well, you I played? remember. Well, you look, sang? I sang, I played, but I don't do it no more. Now I eat. No, and I cook. <laughs> <laughs> you still could sing, without yeah, a doubt. So, so, sometimes, you know, in the bathroom and stuff. No, like no, that. no. <laughs> no, but I'll tell you what. You and another friend of mine, you know, but you really, really took it to another level. It's I like appreciate when it. Uh, when Joe Quasi uh, in introduced you. You are. You make me. I, I get tired just looking at where you're at. Oh. In the last two months, what the hell? I've you been very fortunate. Whole, yeah. I've been very fortunate. Yeah. I mean, and Arizona loves you. Yeah, we're doing our, we're doing Las Vegas next month, yeah. so we're doing you know we're having fun. We're having fun enjoying bringing this music all over the place. Las Vegas okay. is gonna love you. No, thank you, thank you. Absolutely, he's fantastic. I mean, this, I'm proud to say this guy's one of no, my no, best no, friends. I'm blessed, and look, we enjoy what we're doing, so that's what what it is. We have a passion for it. Okay, so now I'm doing. gonna put you on the spot sure. on camera, Laura. 
This right here is for you, okay? Because my good friend Laura, who's like the leader of the Ocean County, okay. which is how many Italians you're going to have in one spot. Mm -hmm. We're going to work on the dates that I can get the club and the dates that he's available. And we're going to put something together real quick. So you better fill that place. Otherwise, Umberto's going to go broke. <laughs> um, in September. We're going to pick a date in September. Biagio's coming, and you will get your picture with Biagio. I already sent her a little shot really? to you tonight. No, I appreciate but, it. No, listen, Thanks for coming. No, it's my pleasure. It was my you know, pleasure. And Let's keep doing this. You got Let's it. Let's enjoy what we're doing. My brother. Thanks. I'll see you soon. Thank you. Thank you, bro. Thank, Thank you, you, guys. Grazie. It's done a great show, all with Italian background. I go back a long way with uh, Biagio, with, back when he was with the Vibrations, and this is a reunion of the Casa Italiana that used to be in Newark. I don't know, if, did you ever have the pleasure of going to Casa Italiana no, in Newark? No, no, no. It was Saturday nights, you went there and you saw all your local nice Italian bands that played, Italian-American bands. Sardi, tell us a little bit about yourself. What have you been doing? Well, I've been doing a lot of acting. You know, right now we're on strike, so we're hoping this thing's going to end pretty soon. But I've been pretty busy. I did did a movie in uh, in Texas. I, there's one on Amazon Prime now. You could check it out if you want to look at it. Called called uh, Mob King. It's a pretty good role. It's kind of a violent movie, but it's a good movie. I did a bunch of stuff. About four or five movies in the last couple of years. Of course, I stay in contact with some of the other Soprano guys. But I've been lucky. I've been lucky. And, of course, The Sopranos really helped me out a lot. I stay in contact with a lot of those Well, that guys. was one of my favorite shows. Yeah, you can't. It's got to be a favorite. Yeah, yeah. And also, uh, in, in speaking with you and stuff, uh, I also spoke to, uh, not, not too long ago, we had him on our show, Lou Martini Jr. Yeah. You've done, you've, <clears throat> you've, 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 uh, done some work with him. Yeah, I just spoke to him this morning, as a matter of fact, because he's going to go see a... a a band that's a few mutual friend of ours. Eddie Testa. Oh, the Eddie Testa. We were supposed band. to go, and I was here. And he's going to be down there with Johnny P and a couple of yep. those guys. And I think he's trying to get up on the stage and sing a song. He, <laughs> does, he does his he does his one two songs. Yeah, though. yeah, I kind of do the same. Eddie Testa's like that. Yeah. But Lou Martini Jr. Good guy. I've done a couple of things with Lou. Well, we're talking to another one of our New Jersey uh, favorite actors here. Um, now, you're New Jersey all your life. I grew up in an Italian section in Providence, Rhode Island, called, Rhode Island. called Federal Hill, the real Italian section. It's kind of like, uh, you know, like Arthur Avenue kind of thing. We were just talking about Arthur Avenue and, with uh, uh, Andrea. And then I came here, you know, I got married, but I've been divorced, but I've been, I was an Essex County person, really, primarily. Okay. But uh, I got rid of my New England accent pretty quick, 
and now people think I'm from Brooklyn or from, from the go. Bronx. Well, Art Rav, yeah, yeah. But it's uh, it's great. It's great, you know. Well, all, it, all the rest of the Northern Italians. Yeah. Well, that's what, like I said. If we don't do, we got to keep our Italian heritage going. Artie, it's been a pleasure. I told you it took a couple minutes of your time. Remember, guys, Artie Pasquale. Check out, was it Mob King? Mob King, yeah. Amazon Prime, or there's a few other things, but check it out. You can get me on Facebook. I'm not on Instagram anymore. I'm trying to get rid of a few people, as a matter of fact. <laughs> but anyway, it was my pleasure. My pleasure. Artie, my Hope pleasure. Hope to see you soon. You got it. And we'll have some of that homemade marinara sauce. Absolutely. We're going to talk about one of your favorite spots. We'll put you on our... Uh, our Jersey Shore Pizza Wars. Come, come and review something with okay, me. Okay, thank you very thank much. Thank you, Artie. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Well, this ends another episode of What's Cooking Destinations. Here from Macaluso's in Hawthorne, New Jersey. A great night. A great night. And uh, hopefully lots more stuff like this to come. On behalf of myself, Chef Umberto, and What's Cooking, my partner in crime, Andrea, Thanks for joining us. Until the next episode, Tante Bella Coast.